Hello everyone, welcome back. This is School IT Help. In this tutorial session, we are going to see the reason and the solution of this common exception, java.lang.unsupported class version exceptions. Let's jump into the discussion. So this is the notepad. So I have noted down few things on which we are going to discuss. So the agenda is very clear. We are going to fix the common error which usually comes when we do the Tomcat integration in IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition. So I want to tell you the reason of this exception. This happens because of the higher JDK version during compile time and lower JDK version during the runtime. This is the pure case of the Java version mismatch with what is required and what we have on our system. So I have replicated this exception here on my system. I'm using JDK 1.8 and I have simply downloaded by visiting the Tomcat official website. Uh, the Tomcat version which I have downloaded is 10.1.x, which I found the latest one. This is the link of the website. Let's visit this link and we will see what's going wrong. So guys, when you visit the Tomcat uh, official website, link so you will be landed here so here we have a uh, different versions to download like 10.0.x and 10.1.1 so what i found this was the latest one so i have downloaded but in case if you don't know the exact version for your jdk version to get the compatible version from this uh, website just click on this which version link so you will be here and here is here we will get all the details this table tell you the exact tomcat version which will be compatible for your jdk in case if you have installed the java 11 or later version so you need to download 10.1.x and in my case i have jdk 8 so the compatible tomcat version will be 10.0.x also if you want to use the Apache Tomcat 9 version, which also compatible with the JDK 8. If you still using the older version of JDK, so for that, that versions, you also have the compatible Apache Tomcat version listed here. So just refer this table and you will get the right compatible version for your JDK. So here for using the JDK 8, I need to download 10.0.x. So I have chosen this one. Click here on this 64-bit Windows zip link and download it. Now the file is downloaded. So I'm putting this thing at separate place. So after putting here, I will extract this zip file. Here we go. After unzipping, zipping, let's look into that. So we have all these files in place. Now go back here in the IntelliJ IDEA. We have to reconfigure the Apache Tomcat setup. So go to the top menu, click here on the run. In the drop down list, click here on this edit configuration option. And you will see run debug configuration window here we have already set up the apache tomcat server but we need to do small change here on the right hand side you can see this is the tomcat package location so click here on this browse button and this browse button will help you to choose the latest downloaded compatible tomcat version so i'm looking for that so i have placed into the different folder so i will select that folder Okay, here I have found this 10.0.7. This is the compatible version for our JDK 8. Okay, selected, that's it. Now, click here on the apply, click okay. Okay, once you do that, you are done. Now, simply uh, close the IntelliJ IDEA once and relaunch it. Okay, the loading is successful. Now on the top uh, right corner, you can see the Apache Tomcat 10.1 server 
at the controls window so here we have the button to start this tomcat so simply click on it and wait for a few seconds on the right hand side you will see the build in progress and this console window will appear in front of you and then you will see some activities going on here after a few seconds you will find a cool message like server startup in three to eight milliseconds now your server is up and running successfully so guys this is the way you can resolve that common error and uh, with the help of this information you can avoid an escape to hit this kind of error at the time of setting up the apache tomcat in the intellij idea community edition i hope you guys found this tutorial relevant and useful please hit the like button and appreciate our work and if you want to learn more please subscribe our channel and for now thanks for watching cool it help